Hello everyone and welcome to Unconventional Sailboat Cooking. My name is Andrea and we are going to be exploring alternative ways for cooking aboard a sailboat. Sailboats typically use propane for the majority of their cooking and we have gone electrical. All of our electricity is generated 100% off-grid and <clears throat> we have never once used shore power and we don't ever intend to. So we are going to be exploring electrical appliances and we also have a wood pellet grill aboard. We're going to be exploring whether a wood pellet grill can actually be used on a sailboat. If you're interested in finding out, stick around. One of the stars of the show is our electric fridge and freezer. We've got quite a bit of storage in here for everything that we need. Some of the unconventional methods of cooking we're going to be using are using induction cooktops and a convection oven. By far the most unconventional cooking item we have is our Traeger pellet grill. I couldn't stand the thought of not grilling again, so I had to give this a try. It runs on pellets, and for every meal we cook, we're going to calculate how, much, how many pellets we use. I've got about 400 pounds stashed on board right now, so we should be able to cook for quite a while. I'm more concerned about the wind, so we are going to be testing this under different wind conditions to see if this guy can maintain its temperature. In order to help you guys ascertain whether this is a good way of cooking or not, for every meal that we cook, we're going to be making a note of the amount of pellets we use, if we are actually using a wood pellet grill, and we're going to calculate our electrical usage for every meal. So. If you guys ever need to upgrade your boat in the future, you can maybe look at this as an option and I can go through all the different components of our system that make this possible. 